my dad might be up. And if he wakes up, we good as caught. Everything. What's up suckers and welcome back to Everything Courtney. Y'all see the robe so you, so you already know what time it is. It's time for story time with self care. Now, I know y'all, it's, it's been a, it's been a couple Sundays since we did a little self care and, but you know, my skin is flourishing though. Like, you know, uh, look at it. Just, I just want y'all to know I'm still taking care of my skin and I hope you is too, but you know, we back, we back and better. We back and we better. Okay, okay, okay. So today I'm gonna do another face mask cause well, I've been in a Vegas heat. Yeah, I'm back from Vegas and um, yes, you know, I'm recuperating, I'm getting better. You know, Vegas takes a lot out of you. But uh, at least this time, I didn't get in a wheelchair. <laughs> Progress. It's really important that you know you take care of your face and so I'm gonna use a deep facial cleanser. Ancient healing clay. That, you know the clay mask, y'all, because honestly, all the pollution, all the just nastiness of Vegas, it gotta come out. Like I just, and I ain't gonna lie, I, I barely drunk water. I drunk water, but my water alcohol ratio was just a little skew, you know, so I, I need to replenish the skin. So we just gonna rock out with this face mask while I tell y'all the crazy story about the time. I almost got caught sneaking out. But it's my, it wasn't my fault, y'all. It's my sister's fault. It, y'all already know I don't like my hands getting dirty, so. Huh. Hope I didn't break it. Stupid. Stay quality. Quality. <laughs> I only need one, I guess. Let me take my watch off because, well, Apple is not. Apple is not made for this. Um, I got my mirror here, so don't freak out, guys. I'm not grazing, okay? Okay. Actually, I'm gonna put my mirror a little closer so I can see you guys. It's, 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 it's good as it's gonna get. It's, it's here, y'all. It's put it on the pillow. So, okay, now I know y'all may be thinking, Courtney, aren't you grown? How you almost got caught sneaking out? Like, grown people don't get caught sneaking out. Well, I'm pretty sure some grown people do, but not me, okay? What you gonna do, fight me, mom, dad? Fight me, I'm grown. But no, nah, um, this was when I wasn't grown and I was still living at home. I was, you know, <sighs> I hate the way this feels. I hate the way this feels. I was, you know, I was either going to eighth grade, like the summer of seventh grade going to eighth grade, or the summer of eighth grade going to ninth grade. I think it was seventh grade going to eighth grade, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. I wasn't fast. Right. I'm not gonna say I was fast, but you know, I just was, you know, agreeing to stuff I wanted to do that my parents wouldn't want me to do. So, that might be fast. Yeah, okay. Oh, Jesus. And so, as I'm planning, like I'm texting, whatever, we gonna call, now, I'm not gonna call nobody by names because I'm not telling all my business. We're gonna call the two gentlemen, uh, Shrek and Donkey. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, if y'all watching, you, you can just guess your character. I promise it's not, it's not personal. Liar! It, it, it's just two friends. Anyways, so Shrek and Donkey, you know, we all cool or whatever, and we supposed to be hanging out tonight. Well, obviously I didn't get parental okay about this hanging out session because it was gonna occur after midnight. And well, it was gonna occur in the house, but you know, I I'm scary. And so I was been, let me tell you something. I was never built for the sneaking, okay? Because I always get scared. Y'all sure we're gonna get caught? No, we're gonna get caught. And I always feel like I was gonna get caught because see, my daddy, the way God speaks to him, he tells them everything, okay? So it wasn't like I could even afford to have a secret because he always freaking find out. So, <clears throat> sorry, I just had a flashback of my childhood. He always knew when something was going on. Anyways, so this particular night, my dad and my mom went to bed pretty decent time. So I'm like, okay, perfect. I'm not gonna sneak up in the house. I'm gonna just go outside and talk to them. She's lying. Yeah. Talking is what I had planned to do. No, nah, for real, look, honestly, I did not plan to do nothing fast. I was just, you know, I'm gonna have a conversation, maybe a little boot up, kid stuff, like hickey there, hickey there, go home Sam, you know what I'm saying? But I don't know if there's intentions with the same thing, but you know, who would know now? Shrek was like, well, I'm coming with Donkey, who gonna come outside with me? And I'm like, my sister, I, I, my little sister live here. She only two years younger than us. We all ain't doing nothing anyway. If she come, I'm definitely not doing nothing. So I thought, so I tell my sister, I'm like, hey, it's the summertime, we're gonna stay up like we always do, but instead, we're gonna stay up outside, okay? They're gonna come through, we're gonna hang out outside. And my sister was like, uh-uh, you're not getting me involved with this, we're gonna get in trouble. I'm like, how are we gonna get caught if they sleep? You know, younger logic really shows how dumb we really were, like, 
just to sum up the fact that I thought, oh, because they were asleep as if they wouldn't wake up. But I had it perfectly planned out. We wasn't going to get caught. Like, I had that type of faith. Like, <laughs> We good, sis. So after a while, it took me a while to convince my sister, right? Mind you, I'm already telling them, yeah, come. She she agreed. I was still in the process of convincing her. I just had a lot of faith. So eventually, my sister finally agreed. And she was like, all right, I'll go outside with you. Now, everything's going good up to this point. You know, Shrek and Dunky on their way. We text like, ooh, I can't wait to see you. Ooh, yes. Uh, all this stuff. Then they get down the street. So... Once they get down the street, I'm like, oh shoot, Shauna, <laughs> they really finna pull up. Instead of my sister being supportive and being like, okay, let me get my shoes. I'm ready, sis, for whatever, ride or die. She wasn't being a ride or die. She was gonna become a ride or snitch. Because instead of her having my back, this little heifer, y'all, all of a sudden, my sister once become the world's most scariest person of eight leg freaks and was like, oh my gosh, it's a spider. Who's gonna kill it? Okay, now mind you, I'm from the country, right? We live in the sticks. A spider ain't nothing. <sighs> now, okay, I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I can admit that I wasn't finna kill a spider because, well, I'm scared of spiders, okay? I understood that part, but it was a baby spider. Baby. Baby. This heifer goes in the hallway to my parents room and wakes up my mama for a baby spider now mind you these gentlemen well you know Shrek and donkey they literally outside they hit me up like oh we over here and then my sister goes and wakes up my goddamn mama so now i'm like hey huh freeze Whatever you do, don't get closer to the house. Because see, I had outside dogs and they snitches. I needed a good time enough to prepare myself to sneak outside before the dogs went to wilding. But see, if they'd have walked up when my mom was outside, we would have got caught a long time ago. This is where the story takes the wrong turn. Now, okay, she wakes up mama. Cool. Mama go kill a spider. Bet, because Courtney wasn't. I can't even finish my face mask talking about this story because every time I think about it, I'm just thinking, Shauna, Whose side was you on, sis? Mind you, my mom gets up. Oh, where's the spider? Where's the spider? I'ma kill it, I'ma kill it. My mama goes to kill a freaking spider. And I'm like, all right, cool, you the hero. <laughs> Thanks, mom. Good night, you going back to bed? All right, good night, love you. Skirt, skirt, psych. My mama hit us with the, oh, scoot over on the sofa. I'm looking at my sister like, why is she sitting down? My mom then says, yeah, you know, I'm not even tired. I can't even go back to sleep. I'm gonna sit out here with y'all for a little bit and watch TV. Huh? Watch TV? I got plans. I got people waiting for me. I got people to see things to do I probably shouldn't be doing. And mind you, you know, God do work in mysterious ways. I ain't gonna lie. Who knows what I would've got myself into if I'd've became Fiona when that Shrek and Donkey charade outside. But that was my decision. Let me be Fiona. Okay, but no, no, Lord Farquhar over here ruins the whole situation and decides to wake up mama. So now I'm sitting in the middle of them, looking at my sister, giving her the death eye. You know we got people outside. You know I had plans. So instead of my plans going through smoothly, now I gotta be the one to tell Shrek and Donkey that, oh, my sister woke up my mama and guess what? She ain't sleeping no more. Now I look like I'm a wimp. Now I look like I'm the punk. I ain't scared to go out there with y'all, but my mama up, so I guess I am scared. And God knows if my mom was up, logic, my dad might be up. And if he wakes up, we good as caught. Because God gonna tell him the moment he open his eyes, they out there. Go see in your front, y'all. And if that had happened, if that would have happened, y'all, I would I would have run away with them. And I left my sister by herself because I, I I couldn't afford to be getting caught, okay? I had a long summer ahead of me. I had plans. I had things to do. I had friends to see. Most sneaking to do. And my sister about to ruin my moment. And so I knew right then and there, sneaking wasn't for me. <sighs> Y'all, time went on. They waited for a little bit. My mama never went back to bed. At least not in the time frame I needed her to go back to bed, right? So we just sitting there having a conversation. And I got little to say, okay? I got a lot I wanted to do to my sister, but I had to wait until my mama left. And when my mama kind of... I looked at my sister and said, You wait till she leaves. It's me and you, heifer. Me and you! Why? I mean, I don't know if it was like, you know, <laughs> just reflex 
decision for her, but she literally was shook. I ended up having to tell them to go home because this wasn't gonna work out, okay? I, I, I couldn't afford getting caught in the big, in the middle of my summer. I had a lot more things to do and y'all wasn't gonna ruin that for me. Shrek and Donkey had to put their tails underneath them and just uh, going back to the house. And so I was like, Lord Farquaad, we got some talking to do. Fiona got some beef with you. My mom finally goes to lay down. I'm like, why would you do that? Why would you wake up mama? And she was like, Courtney, I was scared. <laughs> Girl, me too. I was like, you know, I, oh, scared. We could have been scared outside together. I had your back. It would have fell on me. But no, instead, you took the liberty of ruining my moment. I said all that to say it didn't happen, okay? But you know what? Honestly, looking back, I can't be that upset because, like I said, she probably was looking out for me in ways I didn't realize she was looking out for me. I probably would have got caught anyway, um, not really thinking through because I was just so ready to be like hanging out and doing stuff, I had no business. You know when you're young, that line your parents were like, don't cross, it just be looking like a trampoline. Just like, I just wanna bounce on, just a look. That didn't sound right. Like, can, can I just try my luck? And I really wasn't that child that much. I was willing to become that child. And well, she took that chance from me. So. We laugh about it to this day. I, as an adult, I told my mom that story. And I said, Mom, you remember that night? And so now we laugh about it, you know? <laughs> we can laugh now, but if I got caught, it would not have been funny at all. I can already tell you that. I can promise you it would have not been a laughing matter. It probably would have been a Courtney on a milk carton because my mom and daddy didn't play them games, but I was trying to play them games. And Lord, just thank you for looking out. Who knows who I would have been, but Shrek Donkey, I'm sorry y'all had to waste y'all time to come. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know it was nothing but love, but my sister just wasn't rocking out with it. Like she was just like, huh, not tonight. So, you know, I'm sorry. That's all I can say is I'm sorry. I never really apologized really like that out loud to y'all. Like I know I said it in messages like, y'all, I'm sorry, my sister, my sister snitched. But if y'all watching this, just know, it wasn't personal, it wasn't me. <sighs> Shauna didn't want to do it, okay? It wasn't me, it was my sister, blame her, fight her, fight her. Y'all, that's my story. I just hope y'all had better luck. Please let me know so I don't feel this bad. I really want to know y'all's stories. If you ever got caught or almost got caught sneaking out, please drop down a story below. I, I really want to know. I just want to make sure I was the only person because that adrenaline rush, trying to sneak out, I liked it, I ain't gonna lie, I liked it. And you know this one time, that's another story for another time. Just, just make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that. Uh, that's all, folks. Please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with your friends, family, your neighbor, your enemy, whoever. Let them see it. I hope y'all skin is flourishing. Take care of yourself. Stay hydrated. It's still a hot girl, city girl summer. So if that's what y'all doing, be careful. I'm not saying that's me. I'm just saying. At least do it with some proper skincare. All right, y'all. I love you, and don't forget, you are everything. Bye. See you in a second, suckers.